Hello, this is Edward Ojumbo, the webmaster for ojumboshop.com. Ojumbo.com has a great article, about a great review about Jokosha. Jokosha is a multi-track musical editor. Jokosha uses the GStreamer multimedia framework. The link is www.jumbo.com uh, forward slash review hyphen Jokosha. Uh, you can also visit ojumboshop.com for templates for WordPress, uh, Zencard, and other popular content management systems. In order to follow along with this tutorial, the following tools are required. Your Kosha application, sample audio files for editing, optional microphone for recording voice, knowledge of the audio to be edited. I'll be running two instances of Jokosha on the computer. The first will be recording the screencast audio. The second will be used for the tutorial. Okay, let's begin. Uh, the Jokosha website is www.jokosha.org and its download page is simply uh, jokosha.org uh, forward slash download. I installed uh, the Jokosha program using the Synaptic Package Manager. <coughs> so all I do is do a quick search and type in Jokosha. <coughs> and while that's loading, I'll also show you the the plugins page. <coughs> So I use the Linux Audio Developer Simple Plugin, Ladspa. So we'll go back to the Synaptic uh, Package Manager, and that's the program Jokosha. You see it's already installed. And for the plugins, very simple. It's just uh, Ladspa. <coughs> and I'll show you the plugins I installed. I installed, for example, Blob. Uh, this uh, <coughs> simple plugin here. Okay, now when you run uh, Jokosha, the first time you get this welcome screen. So we create a new pr uh, new project. I'll call it Ojumbo Review uh, Jokosha zero 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 six. It's okay. So the first thing you do is you want to add a new instrument. So you could add a vocal, <coughs> a vocal file. Now, I can't use a vocal file because obviously I'm using the microphone to record this screencast. So what I'll do instead is I'll add an audio file. You can drag and drop in, but uh, <coughs> for this screencast, I'll just this is the file for the image Fabricon. So I'll open it. It's going to be a little slow because I'm running inside a virtual box. Okay, so <coughs> while while this is loading up, um, as I said, you can also drag and drop right from the desktop onto here. So <coughs> it's almost done, just a few seconds. So while that's loading, I'll show you some of the uh, preferences. So you can go to File. Uh, for recording inputs, <coughs> click on change sound system and you can change this for example the encoding you can choose org, flat, wave and others uh <coughs> everything else I just left sample it, I left it at auto detect, system settings, everything is just uh, auto detect for the playback <coughs> okay, another way to get to it is to go to edit and preferences and also brings up the preferences dialog ag again okay so <coughs> for this one it this particular file I can change the name of it I can add some uh, let's go add some effects I click on the effect icon here <coughs> and for example I can add an uh, one of the amplifiers, amplifier mono. <coughs> then what you do is uh, you c you can double click on it or click on the this uh, amplifier uh, <coughs> icon here. And then, for example, the gain is one. You can put it as a gain of two. You can adjust it. Okay. That's uh, <coughs> that's one of the effects, as you saw, I just showed you the effects. 
So uh, some of the other things you can do is you can split the audio. For example, if I just double click right here, see the audio has been split. Another way to do it is to right click and split right at the cursor. See that it works as well. Now to add fades, what you do is you put the cursor anywhere you want and you hold down the shift key, you press enter and then you, you get a bunch of little features here. So what you can do is, as you can see, you can adjust it and that's your fade right there. <coughs> uh, let's see, we can, we can also, uh, for example, we can also uh, add some audio mixers. <coughs> so when you, when you play back, you can change the left to right volume and the volume is actually a little off screen here but you know, go up and down okay uh, what else can we show you uh, uh, <coughs> you have the play uh, fa fast forward uh, rewind stop and uh, you can add a new instrument you go to extensions instant type manager and you click on the add icon name here let's call it Vita 2 and then you also click on the uh, <coughs> you can choose an icon I'll just choose the first one there there you go and you hit apply and OK oops I already made one earlier that's probably why uh, OK and uh, you c if you want to delete it you just go and find it there it is and you just click the delete you want to remove yes <coughs> it's pretty simple. Uh, if you have a free, you can also search for free audio and music from the free sound. I don't have an account, I haven't created one yet. I probably will in the future. One of the cool features about Jukocha, uh, you can also go to minimal mode. Uh, you go minimal mode. <coughs> See, it takes up very little space on your desktop. You can still use a record, play, and stop. And show, for example. And here we go. Actually, the uh, minimum mode is still still there. Just that screen size is so small, you don't actually see it. So I could hide this again from it. Okay, one of the cool things. Let's say I take this part. I can copy that block and paste it up here. <coughs> so what I can do now, I can show you one of uh, mix down. So you go to File, Mix Down Project. Uh, oh, I already made one. Uh, let's make a new one. Okay, let's say I call this uh, <coughs> Jumbo. Oh, what's that? Review. Yo, sure. Zero, zero, 006. Okay. <coughs> See, there's nothing in here. So, what I need to do is I need to add a mix down action. So I press the add icon there and I can pick one of them, add icon, and I can configure by double clicking here or pressing on the configure button here. And you can put the name and the uh, save, uh, save type and where you want to save it. And that's about it for Jokosha. So Jokosha is a simple multitask uh, music uh, audio editor audio for this screencast is actually made with Jokosha. I hope you find this information useful. Please visit ojambo.com and leave feedback.